hey, hey. Spring La Fay, Simple Tarot. Okay, of course, this is a reading for you. Um, bear with me. <laughs> I got slapped in the eye with a tree limb today, and yeah, we were trying to cut some trees around here, and one just popped me right in the eye, and my eye is really hurting. And then I got hit in the head, too, so yeah. Okay, I want to get you one of these overall energy for the sign of Aquarius. Okay, you got two of them. Okay. Luck is on your side. New moon in Sagittarius, and you are good enough. Full moon in Virgo. So, luck is with you. It may not feel like it, but it is. And um, you need to know that you are good enough, you know. People may not see how good you truly are, but you are. You are good enough. Okay. Okay, yin. Number two. Okay. I need another one. To the sea. I feel like that um, right now you need to embrace your feminine side. And if you are a, a masculine and you're like, wait a minute. Everyone has masculine and feminine within them. So it's kind of like um, being a little bit lighter, a little bit, you know, more feminine. Yeah. And to the sea, you know, I feel like... This is kind of like a feeling of uh, casting out your troubles. It's, it's almost like there's a need for release and just allow yourself to just feel what you need to feel and let it go. It, it, it's just heavy. It's got a heavy feeling to it, but you are good enough. You need to know that. You need to, you know, not allow other people's, the way they treat you, to cause you to feel like you aren't good enough. You are. You are. You are. You are. And you need to know that. I mean, really, you need to know that. Because you truly are good enough. Okay. Nope. Okay. Poor Aquarius. swords time to take control it's time to be a leader trying to time to be your own person it's time to um i feel like stop allowing other people's judgments to hinder you because it's only going to affect your health it feels like you've got lots of choices but you may not be interested in any of them. As if this is people. Um, but you've got someone that's watching you from afar. This is someone that sees you as someone who's really got yourself. Someone who can do what you need to do. Someone who is, you know, a king or a queen on your own. Um, they see you that way. Now, I feel like that, you, you know, you have really just come to a point in your life where if, you know, you know what you want. And if, you, you know, if it's not what you want, if you're not feeling something with someone, you're not going to just get with someone just to be having a relationship. It's just not going to happen. Yeah. See, Six of Chalices is often about... Um, for me, soulmate energy. So you know what you want. You want real. You want a soulmate energy. You want someone who is um, similar to you. Someone who um, feels so much like you. And you're going to be gifted. I want you to look at these sixes. We have three sixes down there. Um, this is a gift from the universe, from God. So this could could end up being 
marriage. Ten. Ten of chalices. There's going to be a lot of passion with you and this person. Um, I want to know about them. Okay, tell me about the person coming towards Aquarius. There's someone who's very romantic. Princess of Shells. Um, someone who is a perfectionist with perfectionism and also a leader. Okay. Attitude. Hangman. This person, you know, they may speak their own mind. Okay. Can you, um... Show me their intentions. Ooh, mercy. Okay, hair font. So the hair font can often be about marriage, higher power, um, tradition, and but this person and this has been showing up a lot. Um, may be possessive over you. Um, consummation could be dealing with an Aries or a Scorpio or let's see. Hmm, Capricorn, Consummation, the world, they want to make it happen, they want to make this happen, so they're watching you, they're seeing things from, uh, it feels like a different perspective, um, you look like a challenge to them though, oh yeah, they want a victory with you. Whoever this is, they may have actually looked at you at some point in time and they're reevaluating because they may have, you know, been fearful and they may have not have went towards you, but yeah. Whoever it is, they want a victory with you. Um, you may be like, well, where are they coming on your path? Now, when? You know, some people like to say the, the readings are fluid. I feel like they're timeless, unless I feel like they're not, but, yeah. Um, so, yeah. Okay, show me the cards that I need to see. Show me the card. Boundaries. Okay, you need to teach people how to treat you by being clear on what you will or won't allow so you know that may be why I'm getting that feeling like this person may have looked at you at some point in time you may have put up some boundaries and you know they may be coming back around you know acceptance is well let me show you that oh my goodness Acceptance is the key to inner peace. At times, we must accept things as they are. There is no point trying to change that which is beyond your control or our control. Twin flames. You're passionate tonight. So, yeah, that's why I felt passion with that devil card. You and this person. You deserve love. You are lovable. And yes, you are. You are. And you are enough. So that's what I've got for you. Till next time. Bye.